to talk like this. <laughs> we empower them. Yeah, 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 I'll get them all fucked up in the head. They don't know what the fuck they are. Speeding away. My child had a job. He worked hard. He was the man of my house. He protected me and my kids. She took that from me. It's unconscionable that you would have to put up with something like that for $48,000 a year. Well, tonight, for the first time, we're hearing from an Antioch High School teacher pepper sprayed by his student. He tells us he and the school are trying to file charges. Our Marissa Sulik spoke with him today. He tells us he's had enough and plans to leave the school and the district after this. Caleb Bates says he told his students on Friday here at Antioch High School to put their phones away inside his classroom. When one refused, he says she lunged at him. And that led to this. In this video, you can hear and see teacher Kayla Bates scream in pain. Never scream. Okay, you my phone. It comes after this student in the striped dress pepper sprayed him not once, but three different times on Friday. I've had students cut my hair. Um, I, wow. Uh, I've had students spit on me. Bates has taught in schools. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a, what? They what? They cut your hair? What? Yeah. They spit on you, what the? Spitting on you is nothing. I mean, I expect that, but cutting your hair? Like, that's weird, yo, what the fuck? I ain't never heard of that one before. And I know hella teachers. Yeah, right, exactly, exactly, exactly. I was raised in the house with teachers, man. Yeah, like, cut your hair is like. This guy, this right. guy probably grew up in a liberal suburb. And he thought he was doing some shit. And then he actually got a job. And now he realizes it's a lie. Right. He's trying to get that loan forgiveness, man. Yeah, that's what that's you gotta what, do. Yeah. That's what you gotta do. Imagine doing all this to max out your pay scale at 48 grand a year. Yikes. What a fucking idiot. I imagine they did this to a to a son man. To a son man teacher. No. Nah. They oh, they'd be they'd be five or six dead kids in that class. Right, they would just, never cut his eye from. Yeah, nah, <laughs> that's not even like we wouldn't think to like we would only think to do that to a glider. Right. Like our our imagination goes further when the glider is the Vic. I mean, I've seen yeah. it. I told you I before. I used to work in high school with like with uh, with uh, bad students, and uh, yeah, it was bad with the yeah. glider teachers. You know. Mm hmm. Yep, yeah, I know. Had students cut my hair. Um, I, uh, I've had students spit on me. Bates has taught in schools across the country. This is his first year at Antioch High School. A couple months ago, he says another student punched him in the face for taking his district issued laptop. But this incident in the high school hallway is the reason he plans never to go back. Oh, it got times. in my ear. Uh, this whole side of my face was just a bright red. Um, got in my mouth, nose, everything. I was coughing, hacking. Um, it's a very unpleasant experience. He says he tried to call for an administrator after he was first sprayed, but no one answered because the school is short staffed. So administrators were covering for other teachers. More happened because they were having to take on other people's responsibility. He says the problem doesn't lie with staff at the high school. It lies with those not working there the students when i looked in that video i couldn't see a single student in that class showing concern he believes the <laughs> yeah, empathy man empathy uh, hey yes. he's being honest though he's not blaming it on some bullshit. he's like the Fact. students are fucking shit. <laughs> that, but but that is that, that is a that's a great observation on this part no one had human concern. No, everyone was either laughing, giggling, or insecurating. Yeah, and and not one. That's the thing about like it's a good point. Like out of what I think they have what twenty kids in the class now. Nah, now somewhere maybe like higher upwards of twenty five, probably. Yeah, probably more like thirty or thirty five. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I thought they cut the class. Nah, down. it's like twenty five to thirty. Man. And not one that's a good sample size, man. <laughs> yeah, so not one person showed any concern. 
So I, I think the verdict's in Nick Nick Cannon. Um, <laughs> <laughs> melanin, um, melanin is not right. All that you say it is um, on the contrary. Yeah, uh, and yeah, that's a great observation on this guy, man. Um, you know, I, I still get, I still can't get past the. The, the hair, I'm sorry, I can't. Like, if this guy has kids, a wife, like, how do you go home and, like, like, how do you, how are you, like, like, I mean, how are you a man? Well, I could uh, be a man after this. This, you could yeah. be a man after this. So, so if kid, kids are punking you to that level. Well, I mean, hold on. First, it's a sister. Um, anybody will understand why you didn't retaliate against the Well, no, I'm, I'm talking about like the haircut, right? The cutting his hair, the spitting on him. Oh, yeah, that, that stuff. Yeah. No, no, I, I would rather you spray me than cut my hair because spraying me, well, you're the weapon, but you cutting my hair, like, I'm, a, it's like, am I a bitch or what? Yes, yeah. he's a prison bitch. That's a prison like situation. <laughs> he's a prison bitch. That's at the same exactly. time, but at the same time, it was a kid. Y'all, what you gonna do to a kid? Hit a kid? I would look. I, I, I would at the very at the very least that kid's hitting. He's gonna eat shit. At the very least, he's eating shit. He's going straight to the ground. Am I wrong? Like y'all crazy shit. You go right yeah. to the jail, man. Yeah. No, 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 no. He's he's eating shit. If you're a teacher, right, in that situation, and you're you don't know how to fight. These kids fight all the time. They're, they're very adverse in, in, in fighting. This guy doesn't look much of a fighter. He doesn't look like a he looks like a very slight guy. He doesn't look like he would want to get he into a fucking himself. hand-to-hand conflict with a son. Nah, team. this dude loves Hamilton. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> if, if this guy, he said, the I don't play. know, man. I don't know. Black. I don't know if this guy. He might be straight. He's just a white guy, man. Yeah, he white just guy. he doesn't seem very zesty. No, he doesn't seem zesty. He's white. No, I mean, he's just he's just a like a very soft white dude, that I, like I mean, Hamilton. You you gotta restrain the you gotta restrain him at the least. I I'm telling you right now for a fact, you gotta at the least restrain this little motherfucker. I'm nah, boy, that's, that's I, I, one I, man in Aztec gene talking. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I worked. I, I'm telling you, I worked in these settings, man. Like you got, you can't. You yeah, gotta have you control know. of your setting, man. You can't do no. that in public school. Probably the alternative school, not no public school. Yeah. yeah. And, and if, if you want to be a teacher, and if you want to be I a teacher, bet, I bet I definitely seen security guards. Yeah, security, security guard, security, security guard, not yeah. a teacher. So what's the difference? He's a staff. He's yeah. staff member. A security guard ain't Who? teaching. The, the security guard ain't teaching the class, man. He he was a, 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 a he was a, an adult staff member who was assaulted. The cut cutting your hair like that that's an that's a fucking assault. Be wicked says we need a whip in every classroom. <laughs> a, a, a yo, you know, you know what it is? You know what it is? <laughs> yeah, that, that yo also knows. You know you know what it is? Back in the eighties and the nineties, the teachers were like respected. Like it was like always an older black woman or. Like an older white woman, and they were respected in the school. Only time a teacher gets respected is like a substitute teacher or something like that. But other yeah, than that, substitute. now the kids are like, like it's just, it's way different. You mean yeah? You mean yeah, grabbing? It's different. It's different I haven't seen I haven't, I haven't seen some teachers in um on YouTube videos where they get assaulted, like some teachers black about it, about it. Oh teacher. yeah, and oh, they yeah, get I've seen that. The last like five or six ones with some women getting. One got her leg broke. The other one, the other day, she beat up the girl. Though the last one that I saw, the son woman beat up the girl. She, 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 had, she actually won the fight, but the girl was fucking fighting like a wild banshee. No, I seen um, that one. Good shit. Good shit. Yeah. The students. When I looked in that video, I couldn't see a single student in that class showing concern. He believes the school needs money. And people oh should my write their local God. Stuff. Fuck it all up. Fuck. Swing and a miss. We need to give more money to these fucking sons. These sons have everything, man. Yo, sons are literally rich. All son teams are literally rich. Everything's free. When everything's free, you're rich. 
local representatives. And what I want to know is why is the district not making these failing schools a priority and why is our state legislature not funding our education system more? Now, Bates says he will finish out the school year here at Antioch remotely, and he says he and the school are trying to press charges. In Antioch, Marissa Sulek, W. Against the student or the parent? Hey, he so is he going to teach food. them from a TV screen? Is that yeah. what they're saying? Yeah. yeah. How he fucking did. animalistic is that? You just roll in a TV screen for the kids to talk to the teacher? Well, they're doing, <laughs> they're doing it during COVID. I don't see what the problem is. Yeah, I, that Yo, shit's embarrassing and pathetic. Right, they they're gonna need a, a bulletproof glass around the teacher's desk. Yeah, that TV's gonna get smashed. Right. Yeah, man. Or uh, stolen. Uh, make sure you hit the PayPal Cash App Super Chat. Support the channel. Um, let's let me see. I like Wicked's idea. Like we could just put like an altar in every room and cut their heart out. Cut one of them's heart out and throw it down a flight of stairs. Yeah, man. I, yeah. I, I, I was thinking more. I was thinking more like decapitate them, but the heart's good. Y'all trying to go to joint? Throw yeah. their throw their head through a hoop. Oh shit! Hey bro. man, I I remember one time I was in uh I was doing running a program in Bmore. I stuck one of the kids in the stomach. We we had. We, <laughs> Look, we had all boys. It was it was different. We had all boys in the room. Like they let us do whatever. Like we they let us do whatever. So one time he got out of hand. It was boy. Get, he was just getting out of hand. I stuck his ass in the stomach. I mean, what? but you punched huh? him. You punched him in the stomach. Yeah, in his gut. He lost his wind and everything. <laughs> and what what happened after that? What they tell Nothing. you? He sat the fuck down, and we continued the rest of the day. Nothing right, happened. but. You know, but you know what else happened also? Uh, the rest of them saw that, and they took notes. They, they, they took notice. Yeah, but I didn't even know. I didn't do it in front of everybody. I, I wasn't trying to embarrass them. Like, I pulled them to the side, and I just stuck his ass in the stomach. Maybe a couple of kids saw, but I wasn't trying to make him in. It wasn't that. I wasn't trying to embarrass him. It wasn't right, to embarrass right. him. It was just to get him to the side and be like, look, I will fuck you up, boy. And <laughs> that's what they need to know, because if they don't think that you will fuck them up, that's true. they will take you to the limit. So you have to, I mean, you don't have to. I don't recommend it. Don't do it. I wasn't a teacher. I wasn't on contract. I was just a college student in a middle school. So it wasn't don't do that. But, you know, I, I couldn't do it. That's why I, I would have been a teacher if but I can't yeah. fuck nobody's kids up. So no, well, it's, I, you could be a teacher. Yeah. You could be a teacher. Just go to a nice public school in a um, nice neighborhood. <laughs> Oh, you got to divest as a teacher. But you, you, but you know what? I, I never went hands on when I was in this work in the school for the three years I was there. But the two, three times that I did had to like, like de escalate from them attacking a glider teacher, they, I, I was able to de escalate it, right? Mm -hmm. But I never really, I never had to restrain them or like, you know. Yeah, but, I mean, you want to stay away from that. Yeah, you, yeah. Nah, but I mean, if but say you got say you gotta go hands on, you gotta go hands on. Yeah, no, I'm saying, but you don't want to. You don't want to like. You want it to be a last resort. Yeah, right. That's what it. That's what it is. Because these people are very dangerous, and they know a bunch of dangerous people, and they have people in the right. lives that will come up there and kill you and go do 20 years in prison because you fucking took told them something they didn't like. Just people listen. There's people in every son team's life that will come up to the school, kill you in front of a bunch of people, and go do 25 years in the penitentiary. Right. No, th there was one time I where I grabbed a, a, a gun off of one of the students. Somebody told me that he had a gun. I gra I grabbed this backpack, wow. grabbed the gun, called the police. So I, I mean, they I know they I know they're dangerous. I know that. Yeah, definitely, very dangerous. We have some breaking news to report tonight. Pennsylvania State Police have made an arrest in a road rage shooting that happened along I-95. Alicia Vitarelli following this for us with the latest information in the Satellite Center. Hi, Alicia. Rick and Shari, yeah, police just announced this arrest and we just got video of this suspect moments ago from Pennsylvania State Police. We want to show it to you. This is 25-year-old Chauncey Noel of Philadelphia. He is now facing charges.